Hello, this is Simon. Hello, YouTubers. This is Simon. Then back with the how to draw tutorial, and I'm going to show you today how to make a happy, excited, joyful, whatever you want to call it, chibi character. Start with the curving line going downward to about there, like that, and then another line coming off that. Can make it like curved to about right there. And repeat the same thing on the other side. This is the kind of head I usually use when drawing chibis. Is that, um, it's sure it's lightly so you can erase it if you mess up. Um, now we're gonna just draw a line through the middle. These are guidelines, so don't draw them too hard. Chibi size are usually lower on the head than the regular manga, so draw your lines just like if you were drawing a regular manga person. Like that. And then, so she's really happy, I'm going to draw the classic manga happy eyes. Kind of go up towards this middle to draw a little flow of the eyelid. And the thing about chibis, you don't want to get too detailed, then it kind of takes the point away from it. it. Takes the point away from the chibi. Um. Now we have those done. Kind of thick them up so you can. You can see them pretty good. Now, move on to the mouth. It's just right, like, notice the distance. It's like where the nose would be, but you don't really draw noses on chibis for some reason. Take it over the side. Just make a straight line down. Just like that. And Make little, instead of drawing the lines for the blushes, you usually draw circles like this. Kind of like that. I know it's kind of odd, but that's how they do it in Chibi Land. <laughs> okay, now on to the neck. Neck's not very big. Just make sure you move the head big enough. That's still a Chibi. Now we're going to zoom back out on for the body. Just go to right about right here. She's going to have her arms. Now we're going to move on to the arms. Just the rough guidelines. They're kind of going to be like holding your hands like, oh my goodness, so happy. Kind of like that. Like that. go. You can make the shoulders a little more arched if you want. A little more narrow like that. Um, now I'm going to draw her in this traditional Japanese sailor suit. School uniform sort of thing. There's that. Draw a little bow. I'll make this long sleeved. Now you don't have to put that many wrinkles in the clothing. Hardly any wrinkles at all, actually. Or just no wrinkles. <laughs> um, take it down to about right here. 
Remember, not too detailed. It's just a chibi. Takes the point away if you put too much detail into it. Make sure you leave the head pretty big. Oh, one second. I forgot the ears. <laughs> the ears got like the same spot as the eyes. Not de very detailed at all. Just little things like that on the side of the head. Skirt. Just because she's in the school uniform, I'm going to draw a little quick little skirt here. Pleats. Like that. And now the leg. It's kind of challenging. Don't want to make the legs too big because then it'll be like not a chibi anymore. Sorry for the background noises. It's just mowing. Um. Okay. The feet. Very, very not detailed. <laughs> just quick jotted feet. That one's kicking out if you notice. This one's just. Standing here, she's kind of like really happy. Just like that. Add the little socks. And now I'm gonna move to the hair. Don't, don't just draw. You don't have to draw just this style of hair. Just make up your own hairstyle. Or use your own characters. I mean, like you can convert this pose into your character chibis just anything I'm just using one of my one of my characters right now and, uh, remember not too detailed because I'll take the chibi away the idea of a chibi and I'll add those pigtails Like that. Okay, one more thing I forgot. Around the face, you can add little bubbles, like happy bubbles, kind of helps express your emotion. I see this in anime and manga a lot. Like that. That's pretty much it for the basic tutorial. I'm going to go into time lapse for this coloring, but hope you enjoyed the video so far. And I'll be back with a little it's about more tips. Well, I think that's about it for this video. Um, I just want to thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel. If you have any ideas for future videos, please put them in the comment section so I can... I'll try to do every request I can get. Um, I'll be back with another video sometime this week. And I've, um, I recommend Mark Crilly's channel. He has lots of videos on chibis if you're looking for that. And I recommend his Mastering Manga books. It really helped. Um, they have a whole page. He has a whole page for chibis. Um, lots of chibi emotions. Lots of great ideas in this. All kinds of stuff. So. I recommend you check out his channel, it's just Mark Crilly, and thanks for watching.